Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another episode of Pasties Again. Today we're playing Clockwork Tales of Glass and Ink from Artifacts Monday. Now, um, I had a little bit of fun with the first Artifacts Monday game that I played. It was um, Legends of the Deep, Tale of Davy Jones, I think. This one is about steampunk world that I have to explore and find things in. It looks a little bit more of a move up from the last one, so hopefully the story's got something to tell us. Sixth one this month. Stronger too. I need to investigate this personally. All evidence points to Hawkwall Village, but I'll have to find definite proof. I might need your help eventually, because if I'm right, we are all in grave danger. Well, the grave danger is coming, but um, of course, I'm playing Evangeline. Now, one of the things that I'm actually enjoying about this is uh, female protagonists in the games. I um, think it's probably a stylistic choice for um, for the type of game that it is for those hidden object games, because they tend to actually have a larger female audience that plays them, just for the... I, I, I don't know what it is, but maybe it's just the narrative-driven nature of them, but for me, I enjoy the hell out of this as well. It's, I don't give a crap about female protagonists. I enjoy them, but I don't, well, it's not that I don't give a crap. I mean, I, I like them whenever they're there. I don't care if they're not there, but I don't care if I get to choose. I end up choosing female anyway, so... Whenever it comes to these stories, I feel like the, the narrative's built a little bit more around those characters rather than actually being one of those arbitrary decisions between A or B, where just pick a gender and it doesn't matter, like where the characters are pretty much genderless otherwise. So, um, yeah, Clockwork Tales of Glass and Ink. Let's take a look at the inside. Let's see what Artifacts Monday have brought us this time. It's gonna be a lot of clock work kind of like rhythm to these tunes. So, of course, this is a trial that's available on your PlayStation. You can grab this from any of the PlayStation uh, demo stores. It's either in the US, UK, EU, Japan, Hong Kong. Actually, I don't think it's in Japan, but I think it's in every other one except for that. But yeah, I've got this from the EU store as anybody else can. Of course, you can check it out. Let's see, anything I need to check here. Um, I might just bring down some of this because I'm noticing that the audio levels are a little bit all over the shop. That's a little bit better. So I was actually concerned about the audio being a little bit too high over the top of me. Um, it happened with the previous game. I think there's actually, it's not a matter of them balancing issue. I think it's just they're not expecting anybody to be talking over the top of it. So they just kind of like max out their audio levels all the way through. Because a lot of these games were originally, I imagine, were designed for mobile rather than actually for the PlayStation. So should be the reason why. I can give this a little bit more brightness so you guys can see. There we go. And bam, let's go into it. Right! Okay, so Tale of Glass and Ink, so there's two characters you end up playing through. I'm assuming one that you play through after you've unlocked the other, or it's just because it's an uh, unlocked game. So we'll go with Evangeline. I don't know who Ink is. Uh, normal and Expert. So what's the difference? Is normal, hint, recharge time. Uh, active areas indicated, hidden objects scenes indicated, available actions shown on a map, uh, HO misclick penalty. Right! Well, I'm just going to take normal. No reason to do anything otherwise. My name is Evangeline Glass. I'm an intelligence That's why I have a deal of glass link, right? A few days ago, I received a letter from my mentor, Dr. Ambrose Inc. He asked me to arrive at Hawk Valley. So you're playing, if you're playing as Inc, it's Ambrose Inc, the old man. Inc is like a father to me. He's the only family I have left. I need to find Inc. I think he may be in danger. Yeah, he may be in danger, but also you're in... Dialogue is in danger of being overwritten by the music as well, and the audio. I can't see much, but I think I'm in the right place. Well, considering you can see him through the window? Is that not him right up there? Let's go. It's so crowded. Is that ink on the stairs? <laughs> well, it's actually Panic on the Dance Floor, or it's ink on the stairs. Okay. Um, meet with Ink, sure. Talk to him. Evangeline, Why, hello so there. good to see you. Are you quite certain you were not followed, my dear? Good, well, I'm good. pretty sure. It's, it's a very stormy night, so... Away from the sight of prying eyes. You very perturbed man. Oh, nice to see you too! Hi! Uh, I hear the rest of you people are. 
Ooh, what's that? All right. You just pick up yourself a little clockwork toy there. Oh, I'm touching all the things. Let's touch all the things. All right, all right, fine. You keep just waving. We'll go. Follow me. It's very demanding. Tremors? I'm an old man. I, I can't pick it up myself. Uh, would you mind picking it up for me? Oh, we'll fit through the crack. Okay. Something's going to fit through the crack. Uh, what? Okay. Key and a knob. Right. Um, move that out of the way. Take that. And use the tweezers on that. There we go! Problem solved! I found a useful item! Let's go into the room. Evangeline, oh, that's you a remember beautiful my bird. Crow, Matthew, don't you? Well, he and I... Wait, yes, Matthew? Can this? you just tell me instead of the old man? He seems to be doddering a little bit. I have a bad feeling about this. Um, yes? Get away from the wall! Wow, that is really impressive earthquake. It literally is like, Paw, take the window. Go! Oh, eventually, save Matthew! Okay. <laughs> oh, whoa! <laughs> I think it was it Matthew's big brother, or is it oh, actually like the bird head. from. What happened here? Where's Ink? I don't know, but I'm going to take all the things. Ink's Steambug's collection. Sadly, these are damaged beyond repair. Aww. So many cool steam bugs too. Okay, well, so that's telling me where I need to look at. What am I looking for here? Oh, find parts. Okay. Um. Well, crap. So I need these things. Yes. Um. Get those. I need that. And. Uh, Oh, there we go. I'm trying to find little bits and pieces that I'm meant to be using, but I can't see. There's a wee circly bit that I need. Um, this is where the games grind to a halt. What does that say? Ambrius or Ambu? Eh, whatever. Oh, wait, there we go. There's one. Um, oh, well, there's a green thing I need. Um... Oh, wait! The highlighted ones are the ones I still need to get? Okay, so I was wondering there, I was wondering being smart about it. Um, need a crest D shape. Not gonna be. The thing I need. Uh, don't know what I'm looking for. Don't know what I'm looking for. No? Okay. Annoying. Wait, what? Oh, fair enough. Ah, that one was really obvious. I should have probably seen it. Oh, there we go. Nearly there. The exploration is fantastic, but the actual searching for random bits and pieces is a pain in the hole. Now, I really enjoyed the. Oh, there we, is that one? No. I really enjoyed the way that they did it in Treasures of the Deep, or like. Legend of the Deep, whichever it was, I can't remember. Um, where if you were having difficulty, you could switch across and play a game of Mahjong. Mahjong? Mahjong? Hi. Mahjong! Instead of uh, doing the search, which was really nice. Show me where that arch is, the wee archy bit that I need. Is every 30 seconds? Oh, wait. Every 30 seconds, you're allowed to actually get a hint, so I'm going to use... I'm just going to use three hints to get through this bit. Come on. There we go. Right on the clock. Where was it? Oh, you kept... Mm -hmm. That's really irritating. The weather's calmed down. I can explore the village now. Okay, the weather calmed down because I found all the bits and pieces I was looking for? That's okay. Crew wing. Well, now we're going to put that wing That's onto Matthew. you, big boy. Oh. Boom. What's left of him? Poor thing. 
and need that, and it is right. You change charge a cube of a special device, but where is it? Bring loaded power cube. Okay, so we need to find something else. Ooh, we have to do something to zoom in here. Yes. I'm going back in here because there was something I wanted to grab. Ah, they make me go places. Ink's room, corridor. Okay, so I'm going back in the ink's room because I saw like a little blinky bit over here. Alright, ink for investigating earthquakes. It's over here. Retrieve the toolbox hidden by the git. Alright, so that's what our next plan is. Alright, we go! And we go to the git. Apparently I can go... not go there. What? Oh, right, I know our two bases is missing. Okay. Uh, puzzle rooms, puzzle rooms, all inside puzzles of rooms, and puzzles inside rooms of puzzles. That is the way! Where is everyone? Everybody ran off. Meow! 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 ling 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 Meow! Yes. Let's crank that music box. This party started. Gerhard Barber, his family's castle is here in Hochwald. Hello? Welcome to Hochwald. The safest place in all of Gotland until recently. Until Ever literally like five minutes engineer ago. Ever returned. Now I'll see for myself. Evangeline nah. Glass? It's just as Mr. Ink said. He gave me this for you. Well, thank you very much. I assume that he fixes part of the thingy upstairs. He was working on our dollhouse as a payment. It is not safe here. Let's talk later, okay? Yeah, the dollhouse was unfinished. Buddy's head! Yeah, I'm gonna go to the gate and get this. Like that. Hello there, birdie. Did we shoot you with something? No. Well, ain't that delightful. is underneath here. Right, so I need to find someone to melt it down. Alright, so I don't have all the things I need with me here, I imagine. That's not gonna do it. Wait, does that sparkle? Are you sir? Uh, okay. You enjoy that, little birdie? Yeah? I <laughs> okay, um, and we use that on this. No. Uh, we'll come back to you. Open if I had the proper tools. Mortars. Why did he make such a massive fucking hassle of this is pipe tobacco? Alright, we'll use that and use the matches. Uh, no. Smoke scares most bugs away. So Ah, right, and now we have a lit match. And we use the lit match.
There we go. So used a little bit of the tinder from whenever uh, the bird was sitting there. Use that to melt that and then get that. And then we have that and we use that to that. And we take that out and that gives us a door. Yeah, dollhouse door. That damn useful, yeah, isn't it? Soldier and show your uniform is complete. Man helmet, jacket with a palace, military breeches. Alright, fair enough. I'm assuming there's actually shit going on up here. Um, I don't know if there's tools for this. Imagine I've got enough things now ooh, to wonder why the hell there's an airship leaving. Is that the one I arrived in? Ah, so they stole it. Okay. What's the winding tool? I'm going to take you with me. Strip is now a military facility. There is nothing to see in here. Nine! Nothing to see! Kick, food, whatever. You'll get nothing okay. from me without the license. Or nothing without the license? <laughs> um, do you not know, like soldiers that are talking like that? I'm gonna mess with them at some nice. point. It was a snow demon. Abominable snowman! Good god. These people are easily convinced. What is that? This is why it's some kind of shaft. Alright. I'll give you a Peace. shaft. Yeah. Behind the bar. Why, hello, barmaid. Keep it down, miss. You don't know who might be eavesdropping. Well, so much has changed here since it's in there, body. not drunk because there's no booze there on your shelf. masks, soldiers, arrests, and let's not forget the earthquakes. War is hanging over our heads, and Barbara has some secret weapon up his sleeve. Okay. Your friend, Ink, tried to stop him, but was discovered. Wow. That's all I know. Isn't she like this Miss one guy has actually help. been involved in the, the, the creation of a weapon, I'm sure, because of him being like this ridiculous clockwork keeper? It should be in his boot. Okay, don't need to break in there. Happy days. Oh, oh there, soldier. That son of a... Oh, sorry. Please excuse my language. No, I, I can't. Because I cannot excuse that mustache. It is fabulous. failing to carry out an inhumane order. General Engineer thinks we are all his clockwork, clockwork soldiers, soldiers. As the young lady tried steampunk. <laughs> It is a local drink that kicks uh, like a mule. Sadly, there is no more. I would give up my helmet for another glass. Meow! Today's youth. That barber boy is a rotten apple. apple. I'm not too sure if it's really a good idea to be doing impressions. Dead man. So what's inside here? That is fucking terrifying. True gentleman needs a hat and cane. What's Ken? Oh, there we go. There you go, sir. Oh, that's creepy. You can have your flower, dear. As long as I find the other one. There we go. That solve your problems? Cartographer needs his papers? Boom. You take yours, and... Got one in here, you know. Uh, oh, oh, wait. Aha! Off the shelves. She needs her valise. She happy, lady? Oh my! Looks so fancy! Uh, he needs something for his fire. Wood for the fire. Boom! Put that in there. Get another one of those. 
Put that in there. Got enough fire? Bam! Bitches need plates. She needs plates. Quick, get the plates. And he needs his tools. Well, there's his wrench. But where is his hammer? My hammer is my penis. Uh, she needs some puffy cushions. Buff, don't you jump up and down at me, young lady. Go and have one of those. And there's the other one. Hey! I'm going there, and we use this, and we use a doorknob, and we use a key, and bam! We're making progress. Okay, open up all the things! Oh, right. Oh, God. Alright, arrange the tiles. Okay. Bam! So easy. Just feels so easy, you know. What the fuck? Ah! Cheeky little shit. Fuck you, bug! Some kind of mechanical myriapod. Pictures of me and my pseudo father. Yes, his ID, his passport. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, he was packed, ready to leave. A mechanical myopod with built-in camera. Most certainly a spy designed by Barbara. It's fast and dangerous, but I did manage to capture it. Ah, the cheeky little shit! Dear Aunt Angelina, if you're reading this, something bad has happened to me. I found the proof of Barbara's guilt. He's a dangerous man. He must be stopped. Now you are my only one able... Now you're the only one able to stop him in time. I know I can count on you. Yours, Ambrose, Inc. Doctor, please take care of Matthew. Well, of course. Oh! Well, that's useful. Oh, I need Matthew's cube to be able to do that. Okay. So, obviously Matthew's cube is around here somewhere. No, that's not the case. Um, interact? No. No. Oh, well. Obviously that's just the busted window. What the hell? Oh, that's a good place to change clothes. Oh, there's one in there. Alright, maybe check in on Matthew. Maybe we get access to his little cubby bit if we put his head back on. Yeah, there we go. Hey! Another tremor. They're getting worse. Okay. Anything it jostled that we need? Nope. Here, go over here, put you in there, give you a wee crank, there we go, and pick you back out again. Do we go back to you, Matthew? Hope you're feeling talkative. Hey, projector! Hello! I can't wait for you anymore, eventually. I must find evidence on Barbara. Well, this fuck you, man! I had to get here by blimp! Looks like the most elaborate fast travel in the world. I believe that this is the machine responsible for all the... So essentially, he made a tremor engine. Okay. Earth splitter. Don't like the sound of that. Hey, Birdo. Don't you big bugger and off here. Oi. Thank you. Fuck! It's Ink! Oh I shit! To what him. the fuck? Where is this robot taking him? Son of a bitch! Help me, Evangeline! Yes! Will do! Been stolen by the Iron Giant!
Oh, that's useful. Thanks, Matthew. Together, we will finish this in no time. Mechanical lockpick. Ooh. Okay. So let's go back here. And grab you. What else in here? Yeah, let's just jump down the main street. So he's down by the gate. Can I go over here if I get in trouble? Project Tremor final phase. Project Tremor? Okay. No one is to disturb General Engineer. Oh, shit! You motherfucker! Ah! It's gonna go in there. Um. Let's see, to use the- oh, whoa, okay. Did not expect that to be anything useful. Okay, do I need a pair of forceps or something to lift these things up? Oh. Well, that's useful. ha! <laughs> You're all dead now! <laughs> Alright, so I've almost got my toolkit. Alright, so... Where next? Yep, yeah, up, oh, there we go. Then of course we have the bit for this. Yay! I don't even know what that was. Wire cutters. Useful. Pick. Oh, it's a metal bar. And then maybe we should use that, or that, or that. No, none of that. None of that'll work. I'm gonna remove the snow. Right. Well, I imagine I'm going to need a shovel. Hey, they if brought back an air ship as well. Ah. Then maybe by air. Thank you. Ah, you bastard. Thank you. What the hell is in this? Uniform! Alright. So. Maybe if I go up to you, I use this. Take it and leave my sight. I got the Ubers I ass, you fuckhead! Thank you. All your drinks are in the house. I hope you find your friend. I hope you find your friend. Why, well, thank you. I would give up my helmet for another glass. We get steam horse drink. Measure the right amount of cool each. Okay, so let's see. To make five, so I need the five, three. I need five of that. So uh, five, oh, five, three, five goes in here. So I need right. So all oh, right. So I need five of that. I need to lift that and lift you and do you. Then leaves me two. Which goes in here. 
then the last one is I need one of that. So hmm. How do I get that one then? So I need to get one alright, this this is actually full on Die Hard with a Vengeance level. Uh how do you get to exactly two gallons? I got the exactly two gallons with a five gallon and a three gallon jug, but how do I get one gallon? So five gallon into three leaves two. Aha! Yes, I got it! <laughs> five into three leaves two. Three into drain. No! I've got two left in here. I pour the two into here. Oh! And then I put five into here. Five into three leaves me with four. Three into drain. Four into three leaves one. There we go. <laughs> I'm a mix master extraordinaire. Goddamn there. Bam. Thank you very much. I'll take that. Hey, chap. How would you have we said that? I believe it. Steamhorse. Steamhorse. I said I would give up my yes. helmet and I would keep my word. Take it, lady. It's yours if you want it. <laughs> yeah, I do want your helmet. <laughs> Want your boots, your coats, and your motorcycle? Today's youth. Uh, boom! Let's see. Anything else I have in here? No. Nothing I can claim. Right, in here? Can I put on that? That? Still need a jacket? Where am I going to get the jacket from? Still trying to think. Meow. We. Let me see. Something for me to do here? No, not really. Hmm. Wait a second. If I do this. <laughs> Something where I am right now, an available action. So I need to do something here. Ooh! Shit! Get him! Get the motherfucker! Is that a jacket? Oh! That's useful! Yeah, I'll go back inside and I'll get it. And there we go. I was wondering why there was another thing I had that to go. Damn worm took a picture of me. It'll expose my plan. Grab him. Go on, Matthew. Shoot, he escaped. We should watch out for him, Matthew. <clears throat> kind of regretting actually tapping that goddamn glass. Is that the difference between a good and bad ending? Whether or not you actually like tap the glass and let that thing on? My disguise is ready. I can board the Zeppelin now. <laughs> we still haven't seen your face except for actually like in promo materials. Okay. The helmet is creepy. I do not drink with the likes of you anymore. We don't want more soldiers here. Go back to your Zeppelin. <laughs> Cat doesn't like soldiers either. All right, so Zeppelin and then we go. Hurry up, soldier! We are getting off the ground any time now. We are getting off the ground. Okay. Oh, you little shit! Come here. I'm going to crowbar you to the face. Son of a bitch! 
Well, apparently that's all as far as we can take it here in the demo of Clockwork Tales of Glass and Ink. That's actually was pretty good fun. Um, I, I miss having the uh, option to do the Mahjong instead of actually doing the hidden object game. It's a, I, I think it was actually something I enjoyed better in the previous game that allowed me, although admittedly the last game was very heavily involved with uh, hidden object stuff. But this seemed to be more of object usage. It was a lot more, almost more like a point and click game from a first person perspective that it was a hidden object game. So yeah, I think I got into the logic of this pretty easily. Um, I would happily play through more of Clockwork Tales, it's really good fun. Um, previously to the last time I actually did a comment on an Artifacts Monday game, I really want to finish off uh, Tales of the Deep, so if you guys enjoyed this and you enjoyed Tales of the Deep, uh, make sure to give me a shout, tell me that you want to see more of this, or if you want to actually play the games yourself, because Artifacts Monday are a pretty awesome company, they, uh, they have offered the a key, a key code or two to give away as a gift here on the channel so if you liked it comment underneath and um, I'll put your name in for a quick see well a quick giveaway essentially whoever's comment underneath and watch it all the way to the end will probably get a benefit of it so um, yeah thank you very much for watching guys if you enjoyed what I was chatting about why I enjoyed what I said during this video of course all about clockwork tales and steampunkery you can hit the subscribe button up here at the top and that'll actually point you all towards anything that's actually coming out recently and will inform you when new stuff comes out and over here you can actually check out the other video for the artifacts one the games I've already played and the other games that are I've been playing on the station and on the channel so again thank you very much for watching I will see all you dudes in the next video Bye.